we are going to take a pretend trip to the beach today and we are going to see what we might see at the beach and then we are going to pretend that we are either being what we see or doing what we we see so the first thing you might see at the beach is a seagull okay they are very very common to see at the beach and what do seagulls do they fly so we are going to fly like a seagull you're going to stand up and you're going to have your hands at your side you're going to have your belly tight nice and tall we're going to raise our arms up and touch and back down Okay, we're going to do that five times. Tighten your belly muscle, shoulders back, nice and tall, and arms up, touch and down. One, arms up, touch and down. Two, arms up and down. Three, arms up, touch and down. Four, arms up touch and down five awesome so the next thing you might see at the beach is sand and we like to play in the sand don't we we like to dig so we are going to get into a squat position do you see the little boy his knees are bent his hips are bent and his feet are flat so we are going to get into a squat position and we are going to dig. So from standing, you're going to bend down, okay? And you're going to try to balance there without holding on. If you have to put your hand down, that's okay, but try not to. We're going to be nice and tall and we're going to take our pretend shovel and we're going to dig and come up. Now the other hand dig and come up let's do five each side one one dig two two dig three three dig four four and one more dig with your right and dig with your left good job guys Another thing you might see at the beach are waves. That's very common to see waves at the beach. So waves go back and forth, and that's what we're going to do. So you're going to stand back up, and we're going to do, we're going to fly in the wind like eight waves to the right and to the left. You want to stand nice and tall. You want to make these muscles work as you go side to side. So put your arms up and we're going to go one direction and then the other. And we're going to do that five times each way. One, one, back the other way, two, two, three, three, four, really stretch, four, last one, stretch and stretch. Good job. This is a surfboard. You might see people in the ocean that are riding the waves. We're gonna pretend that we're riding the waves. So you are going to stand and you're gonna put one foot in front of the other. And you're gonna, uh, let's say it's your right foot. Let's put your right foot out first. Your left foot is behind, belly muscles tight, shoulders back, and take that right arm and put it right in front of your body and your left arm um, behind your body. And then you're gonna bend your knees like you're surfing and look out over that right hand and come up. We're gonna surf again, ready? We have to bend our knees when we surf. And come back up. That's two. Let's bend our knees and surf. That's three. Bend our knees and surf. That's four. Bend our knees and surf. That's five. Now we have to turn the other direction. 
So you can either twist your body or you can put your left foot out in front and your right foot behind. Tighten those belly muscles, shoulders back, your left arm out in front, your right arm behind, and we're gonna surf. Bend those knees. We're surfing. And come up. Bend those knees. We're surfing. And come up. That's three. Bend those knees. We're surfing. And come up. That's four. Bend your knees. We're surfing. And come up. That's five. Good. All right. We have... What's this, guys? This is a crab. You might see them in the water or you might see them digging their way in the sand. We're gonna make our bodies look like a crab, okay? So you're gonna sit down on the floor like this. You're gonna sit with your bottom on the floor, your knees bent, your feet on the ground, and both hands behind your, behind your body, okay? And then you're gonna tighten your belly muscles and you're gonna lift that bottom up and hold it up there. This is a crab position. Now we're gonna come back down. We're gonna try that five times. Ready? Up, one, and down. Up, two, and down. Up, three, and down. Up, four, and down. Up, five, and down. All right, now if you weren't able to do that, you can do a bridge. So you're gonna lay down on the floor and you're gonna lift your bottom up. Okay, this is half of a crab lifting up, just like that. Okay, <clears throat> we have one more thing to do. The last thing you might do at the beach is go for a swim in the water. So we are going to go swimming. You are gonna lay on your belly. And you're gonna put both arms out in front of you, your legs behind you, and you're gonna to try to raise your hands up and your legs up, and then you're gonna flutter. If you can't do that, you're gonna raise your arms up and flutter your arms, or you're gonna raise your legs up and flutter your legs, okay? And we're gonna to try to do that 10 times. Ready? Let's lift up arms or lift up legs or both. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Very good, guys. That was awesome. So you can practice these at home. You can show your mom and dad that you went for, to a, the beach today and you were a seagull. You went digging in the sand. You were like a wave in the ocean. You were surfboarding. You were a crab. And you went swimming. Thank you. Have fun.